Welcome back to Wicked Dad Painting. Let's paint some Nemesis eggs. Alright, welcome back to Wicked Dad Painting for another Nemesis Painting video. This one's super easy. We're just going to be painting up these egg tokens um, that came with the Kickstarter. Um, just going over the colors really quick here on the palette. I've already base coated everything with Black Templar uh, contrast paint. And then just done, did some light dry brushing and edge highlights with Vallejo Gunmetal. Um, I actually think we'll see that part in the video. Just to bring out some of the metal bits that aren't covered in slime. For the slime itself, we're going to use Cable Light Green, um, Moot Green. We're going to highlight both of those with Ivory. And then I've also got some fluorescent paints from uh, Green Stuff World, the yellow and the lime. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. So this is edge highlighting with the metallic bits. Basically, we just want to pick out some of these mechanical structures. Now, again, you know, these are just tokens. They're really not going to be in the game a whole lot. So we don't want to go too crazy. Uh, we just want to get some edge highlights on there um, to show that it is metallic. And then, of course, the floor as well. So we'll get that um, just metallic up a little bit. Really just hitting those prominent edges more than anything else. I'm going to speed through getting the rest of these done. Um, it didn't take really long to do this step. Uh, it's fairly quick. I won't say painless because it's tedious, but it is quick at least. All right, so and then we're going to come in just with the moot green because we want this slime to be really bright, poisonous looking. So I went straight into the moot green here. Um, because it's contrast paint, the green is going to show up pretty well on the parts where the contrast paint did not stick, right? Normally taking a bright green like this over black would be a huge pain in the butt. Um, but because it's contrast, it does leave those, uh, brighter areas and the green goes over it just fine. Um, and I believe I just did one coat of that. And then I come through with one coat of cable light green to hit all this gooey, you know, the egg pustules, basically, and surrounding areas. Now, we are going to highlight those here in a minute, but first, let's get them all done. So I did batch paint all of these. Um, this is where you can kind of see me highlighting. It's basically just a mix of the ivory with the cable light green. And then over that, obviously, once that's dry, this is when I come in with the green fluorescent and just cover these. Now, the reason why those are kind of a bluish color underneath rather than the moot green is because I wanted these to look just slightly different than the actual gooey slime. So one coat of that highlight, and then you can see it's kind of patchy. Um, that's on purpose. Um, every part of this egg, right, it's a pulsing kind of grotesque thing. I wanted there to be some variation. So we'll go ahead and throw down this fluorescent green and we're really starting to get that more uh, alien life form type of look with that. And then we're going to come in with the fluorescent yellow and use the fluorescent yellow over the moot green. That way we get that really poisonous, gooey um, kind of look on all that slime uh, that we really like. The fluorescents were, were pretty good here. Um, I'm holding judgment on them for now, but we'll see. And then I added some white, or some ivory, sorry, um, and kind of highlight that up a little bit. This is me fixing a mistake. I, those were white, and I put the fluorescent right over it, and it looked terrible. So I come back in with that cable light and ivory, um, and then I hit that with the fluorescent green uh, after the fact. So yeah, it's okay to mess up. Just go back and fix it. There's paint. Um, and that's pretty much it. Um, so yeah, if you have any questions about these, definitely leave them in the comments. Um, this game is super fun. And, uh, oh, actually there is one more part. I didn't realize that there were still some left on this. Um, there are some aliens kind of popping out, some, some of the larva. So I'm painting those similarly to where I painted the larva in the last video I made for Nemesis. Just Ishabti Bone. Um, we got kind of zoomed in here so we can see they've got like the legs sticking out and crawling all over stuff. Their heads are definitely sticking out. Um, so we just want to pick those out as they hatch. Kind of ties them into the rest of the intruders. So yeah. Um, again, fun game. 
Uh, if you have any comments, definitely leave them down below. Any suggestions? I know the video quality needs some work. Obviously, my um, video skills need a little work as well. But if you like the short format like this, um, just let me know. Thanks. Uh, go out there and paint something wicked.